Hello everybody, I'm your host James Moran. Welcome to Real Talk with Raven Films. On this show we're going to talk with the fine members of Raven Films and to find out just what their organization is all about. I'm seated here with the president and founder, Sam Sanchez. Thanks for coming by. Uh, thanks for having me, James. Pleasure is all mine. All right. So what is Raven Films exactly? Uh, we're, we're a full-fledged film crew, man. Um, we're, we're, we're just a group of people who love film uh, and filmmaking specifically. Uh, well, we're not exactly satisfied with just watching film and talking about it. We, we want to go make it. Um, and so we're just all about uh, exploring the medium uh, as in-depth as possible uh, in, in all of its aspects and everything you can do with it. All right. So when did you start and what idea did you have behind starting this group? Since spring semester of my freshman year, um, but it, it was a slow start, uh, obviously, it being a very unique kind of student organization. Definitely. We had our, our kinks in the road uh, when we first started. But uh, I, I came to Sam Houston. Um, and again, you know, I, I love film and uh, theater and, you know, all, you know, kind of this, this world, if you will. But there wasn't a group that really facilitated that, you know, independently. Uh, and so uh, I thought it would be a wonderful thing if, you know, I just started something like that. And, you know, hopefully, you know, I can build some manpower and support. And, you know, slowly but surely, you know, it, it really came together and became what it is today. And, uh, and even today, um, it's, I, I still feel that we haven't quite scratched the surface of, you know, everything that can be done with the medium, so. All right, so how many members does it have currently, and how many did you start with? We, right now, we're actually at about 30 members, uh, which, which is that really good, really exciting. Uh, we started out um, with seven. Yeah. There were just seven of us. Uh, and actually, out of those seven, there's only two of us. Uh, to this day, um, uh, myself and my vice president, Ashley Smith, uh, we're the only two still here out of the original seven. So. And since its beginning, how many productions or major productions have you guys produced? Uh, major productions, because um, I mean, we do smaller workshop productions and like smaller little things, but as far as the big ones, uh, we have, there's six under our belt so far, the last of which has actually won five awards, mm. so very exciting. Um, and sh uh, pretty soon we're actually going to be embarking on our seventh production. Uh, we're in pre-production right now, um, and uh, pretty soon uh, we're actually going to get the camera rolling on that and begin principal photography, so very right. excited about that. Well, now that we know a little bit more about Raven Films, let's hear from its actual members. I love Raven Films because it gives me a, a core group of friends that I can hang out with and discuss movies with. I feel a sense of responsibility for it and having that leadership role really gives me something a little bit extra. And not only that, Raven Films does provide me with that little bit of experience that will do great for in the future. Uh, the most I usually get out of Raven Films is this real sense of familiarity because it's not too big, it's not too small. It's very compacted and we all pretty much know each other. We have fun, have a lot of interesting discussions, especially on film and filmmaking. Definitely the, the friendships that we get because, you know, everybody in there is a really tight-knit group. We all participate together, we write together, we film together. So it's, above all else, above learning film and how to make movies, we also you know, gain a lot, of, a lot of friends, which is one of the biggest parts of why people join organizations like me in college. Now that we've heard more from its members, we'll be right back to hear more from Sam and Raven Films right after this break. A, B, C. Mommy says it's time to clean my hands. E, F, G. First, I wet my hands with clean water. H, I, J, K. Then I put soap on my hands. L, M, N, O, P. Then I sing the A, B, C's. And I rinse my hands with clean water. And finally, I can dry my hands with a towel. Now I know my ABCs. Mommy says it's okay to use sanitizer. Next time, won't you sing with me? 
And welcome back. We're here once again with the president of Raven Films, Sam Sanchez. All right, Sam, so what, do you, what would you say was the biggest production Raven Films has made as of yet? Uh, definitely Zone Zero Decampment. Um, we, about two years ago, we did uh, the first Zone Zero, which was kind of, kind of an experiment in the group. They were like, Let, let's try a zombie movie. And right. so we dived in and we we're like, okay, let's take this to the next level. And so Zone Zero Decampment is that. Um, and so, as you can see right here, uh, huge, huge production. Uh, it took us a, a whole semester. Uh, actually, starting from January, uh, before school even started until May, after school had already let out, uh, we were working on that project as far as uh, principal photography goes. So a uh, re really big undertaking. So a zombie film, you say. Uh, can you give us a little insight to its uh, story or its synopsis? Um, essentially, uh, it's a group of survivors um, who have kind of been quarantined inside this town that is just dead all around them. Um, it wasn't Huntsville, Texas, was it? No, no. not at all. Okay. All yeah, right. Yeah, totally Huntsville. <laughs> um, and it's it's just the four of them, and they decided to take it upon themselves. They're like, let's make a zombie movie because there's really nothing else to do here. Everyone's dead or trying to make us dead. So uh, let's just make a zombie movie. You know, we got real zombies. You know, real footage. You know, who who wouldn't want to see this? And so uh, it, it follows their story, their journey of trying to make this movie happen and then all the kinks that go along with that. Well, okay. Uh, let's head back and hear some more from uh, Raven Film members. Raven Film sets are always pretty crazy. Um, the best one that I think I've had is when Raven Films did um, family settings over the summer for the 48-hour film festival. And we just went crazy on the set because we had lots of time. And because it was 48 hours, there was a lot of um, improv going on at the same time. And so that improv was really quite hilarious. And we had a hard time keeping straight faces while on the set. I would say probably in both Zone Zero movies, when I was in zombie makeup for the whole day, got sunburned, had nothing, was wearing nothing but a wife beater, pretty much. Um, ripped jeans and all that. Probably me having to drive my truck like about 60 miles per hour down uh, next to the parking garage over and over, scaring a lot of people and um, you know making a lot of people run for their lives and that was always crazy having to look back and see about 10 or 12 zombies running at me and I really felt the urge to just speed away so that was probably one of the craziest things I've ever done on set. So Sam, how does one become a member of Raven Films? Uh, just come to our meetings and be an ap active participant uh, in everything we do. Uh, we meet uh, every Tuesday at 5 o'clock, 5 p.m. Uh, the room actually varies per semester, depends on availability in the LSC uh, and such. But uh, you can always see our flyers uh, around campus posted on the bulletin boards, and they'll have uh, you know, the information. But it's always Tuesdays at 5, and you can figure out through one of the flyers. Or online, we actually... Uh, ravenfilmsshsu.org is our website and we also have our meeting information there uh, and we also have a blog that gets updated weekly with the, me with the uh, meeting minutes and kind of the going ons of the group and that's uh, ravenfilms.blogspot.com so. All right, now we know a little bit more about Raven Films. I just wanted to thank you, Sam, for coming to the show and, and telling us about your wonderful club. Oh, thank you. Thanks for having me. Yeah. This has been another session of Real Talk with your host, James Moran. Uh, we'll see you on the next Reel.